Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is the Cartoon Man 13 here. And welcome to my 60 second Blu ray update and my 60 second DVD update, in which I got one DVD and one Blu ray at Target and one Blu ray at Walmart because Target didn't have it. And then we went to Walmart and I got it there. So that's three movies I'm going to show you. But before we do that, um, a few celebrities have died, but as of recently, but one in particular, she's, she's, uh, I can't believe she died. Well, of course, we all know her as Princess Leia from Star Wars. And that certain celebrity who died just happened to be Carrie Fisher. Of course, we all know Carrie Fisher as um, Princess Leia from Star Wars. Of course, the original Star Wars trilogy, which I have on Blu-ray and DVD, and most recently in The Force Awakens. Of course, I also do have the prequel trilogy, which, yeah, I can do without the prequels, but, you know. Carrie Fisher did a great job as Princess Leia in both the original trilogy and in The Force Awakens. And, uh, it's such a sh shame that she died. And I want to give out a little moment of silence to remember her and her passing and all that sort of stuff. And here we go. May you rest in peace, Carrie Fisher. You were a great actress. Really good female actor. Sometimes I hear it both as actress or female actor, but you know, it doesn't really matter to me. But you are great as Princess Leia in Star Wars. Or, or General Leia in The Force Awakens. But, um, yeah, and a few other celebrities died, not just Carrie Fisher, but... Her mom, Demi Reynolds, also passed away as well. And George Michael passed away as well. And of course, one of George Michael's songs was used in a movie that I just got on Blu-ray. I'll show in a minute, but uh, yeah, I just want to do a brief little moment of silence for both Demi Reynolds and George Michael. I feel they deserve it as much as Carrie Fisher. So here we go. May you rest in peace to Debbie Reynolds and uh, to George Michael and to Carrie Fisher. Excuse me, sorry about that. I just had some Taco Bell. Like, literally every video, I. Yeah, I'm pretty gross. But going back to seriousness, rest in peace, Carrie Fisher. Rest in peace, Debbie Reynolds. Rest in peace, George Michael. You were all great people, especially Carrie Fisher. You were great as Princess Leia in Star Wars. I know I keep repeating myself, but that's exactly how I felt about her performance. We see her in the middle there between Chewie and Luke Skywalker. Then the back of the Blu-ray of The Force Awakens. And we see, like, another picture of her. Sitting right next to Han, standing right next to Han Solo. At least Mark Hamill and Harrison Ford are still alive and well. Well, of course, Carrie Fisher had to die, and it it stinks. It does. But um, yeah. Two thousand sixteen was a horrible year for deaths, for celebrity deaths. But these three had to end 2016 celebrity deaths with a bang. Carrie Fisher, George Michael, and Denny Reynolds. Especially Carrie Fisher. Carrie Fisher is the one I'm most fond of. And yeah, rest in peace to all the celebrities who died in 2016. Like David Bowie and Prince and China and... uh. What other celebrities died in 
Merle Haggard passed away as well. And, uh, yeah, it was a tragic year for deaths. And it stinks. So, rest in peace to everyone who died in 2016. Or at least the celebrities and family members who died in 2016. So, may you all rest in peace. But getting off the depressing subject matter, um... What, like I said at the beginning of the video, this will be my 60 second Blu-ray update and my 60 second DVD update. This is a special post-Christmas edition in which, I, like I said earlier, I got one Blu-ray and one DVD at Target and one Blu-ray at Walmart. Three movies to show you. And yeah, this is the special post-Christmas edition of the Blu-ray and DVD update series. And uh, yeah, so why don't we get things started? with um the DVD that I got at Target. I mean, I, my grandma actually got this DVD at Target and she really likes this movie and you know what I happen to like the movie as well and that movie is Spy. From writer and director Paul Fagg, the director of Bridesmaids in the Heat, starring Melissa McCarthy, Jason Statham, Rose Byrne, and Jude Law, the funniest movie of the year, says Mara Reinstein of U.S. Weekly. An action comedy home run, says John DeFore of The Hollywood Reporter. Special features include top secret gag reel, extra top secret behind the scenes gag reel, Susan and her men, the great Rick Ford, audio commentary, gallery and the theatrical trailer. This is a 2015 film and a 2015 DVD release from 20th Century Fox Home Entertainment. Rated R for language throughout, violence and some sexual content, including brief graphic nudity and is 120 minutes. So inside here you get a brief little, you get this coupon thing which already expired when I got this. And here's the disc for Spy. And that was Spy. And that was the only DVD I had to show for this update. And uh, yeah, let's move on to the Blu-ray that I got at the same Target. Of course, it's in my top three favorite movies of the year. I love this movie. I had to get it, and of course, it's a Marvel Comics movie. In my last update, I already showed you Captain America Civil War, but now I have another Marvel movie in my possession. It's now, well, it's a Fox movie, but it's based off of a Marvel property. And that movie is Deadpool. Yes, Deadpool. Um, Like I said earlier, one of George Michael's songs is in this movie. And Careless Whisper was the song that was used in this movie. They also used DMX's X Go and Give It To You. And, um, hold on. What, girl? Okay. I already did. I already started the dryer. You're welcome. You're welcome. Anyway, sorry about that. That was my grandma. She wanted me to check if the uh, towels were done in the dryer. But anyways, going back to Deadpool, um, one of George Michael's songs was used in the movie. And that song is Careless Whisper. There are some other popular songs that were used in the movie, like Shoop by Salt and Peppa, X Gonna Give It To You by DMX. Um, I think You're the Inspiration by Chicago was also used in the movie as well. But, yeah, going back to Deadpool. Of course I had to get it. It's Deadpool. Coincidentally, I'm wearing a Deadpool t-shirt. What uh, it's a coincidence, right? Coincidence, just total, total coincidence. 
Look at that. It's awesome. I even wore this shirt when I saw it in IMAX. And, uh, yeah. But anyways, um, going back to the Deadpool Blu-ray, here's the front of it. I know I've been taking a lot of time here, but anyways, here's the spine. And the back. I give it four Golden Girls. It's the best picture of the year, says Betty White. Disc one Blu-ray includes deleted and extended scenes with audio comments with option. Disc one Blu-ray includes deleted and extended scenes with optional audio commentary by director Tim Miller. Gag reel from comics to screen dot 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 to screen gallery. Concept art costumes storyboards previous stunt viz. Deadpool's fun sack. Audio commentary by Ryan Reynolds and screenwriters Rhett Reese and Paul Warnick. And an audio commentary by director Tim Miller and Deadpool co-creator comics artist Rob Liefeld. Disc 2 DVD includes Gag Reel and Deadpool's Fun Sack. This is a 2016 film and a 2016 Blu-ray release from 20th Century Fox Home Entertainment. Rated R for strong violence and language throughout. Sexual content and graphic nudity, and it is 108 minutes. So the back of it is just the digital HD code, but I like how they made. And of course, in the actual movie, that popular line of dialogue where Deadpool was like, "Oh, I'm touching myself tonight." Well, apparently, on the back of the insert right here, it says, "Go ahead, touch yourself." It's something that has to do with the. Uh, Testicular Cancer Awareness Foundation. So I'm glad Deadpool's doing this um, testicular cancer thing to stop people from getting that, or at least, you know, stopping it while they're battling it. And uh, yeah, nice thoughts. But, uh, anyways, here's the, the Blu ray is, of course, the Deadpool thing, Deadpool's mask. And the DVD is where Deadpool gives the thumbs up. And when I got this, when it was completely sealed, it came with this little sticker right here. It says, go deeper inside Deadpool. Flip me over to find out more. And I read, read the back of the sticker and there was nothing on it. So, yeah, it, like it was originally in the front cover here. But when I open it, I put the sticker here. And, um, yeah, that was Deadpool. Of course, both of these I got at Target. And the one Blu-ray that I got at Walmart, because Target didn't have it, so and then afterwards we went to Walmart and I wanted to see if they had this movie. And really enough, yes, they did. It's another one of my top three favorite movies of the year. I love this movie as well. And that movie is Hardcore Henry. First they made him dangerous, then they made him mad. Joins Mad Max Fury Road as one of the best action movies ever, says Kaylin Corrigan of Shock, of shock Till You Drop. I, I don't know if I would consider this to be one of the best action movies ever. But it definitely is one of the best action movies that came out this year, 2016, which this year is almost over. And yeah. HD picture and theater quality sound. Special features include deleted scenes, fan chat, and a feature commentary with director and producer Ilian Nyshuler and star executive producer Charlotte Copley. This is a 2016 film and a 2016 Blu-ray release from Universal Studios Home Entertainment. Rated R for a non-stop bloody brutal violence and mayhem throughout. Language throughout. Sexual content, nudity, and drug use. And it is 97 minutes. So let's open this thing up. The back of it is the digital HD code, but there's a promo for 4K Ultra HD. Lucy, Oblivion, Lone Survivor, Everest, and the Huntsman Winners Awards. Just telling you about 4K Ultra HD, which I don't really need 4K Ultra HD. I'm fine with the regular Blu-ray, but um, yeah, it's just ways of getting more money. And uh, yeah, 
I don't really need 4K, 4K Ultra HD that much. I'm fine with regular Blu-ray, but anyways, here's the disc of Hardcore Henry, which is pretty lame if you ask me, but hey, at least the movie's in there, and uh, yeah. And that was Hardcore Henry. Well, that's going to wrap it up for this special post-Christmas edition of the Blu-ray DVD update series. Here's a quick little recap of what I've gotten. Of course, these two I got at Target. This one I got at Walmart because Target didn't have it. And, uh, yeah. I really like all three of these movies, and I'm kind of glad I have them. I'm really glad I have them, actually. Excuse me. Of course, I had to talk about it anyways. Um, that's going to do it for this video, guys. Rest in peace, Carrie Fisher. Rest in peace, Sammy Reynolds. Rest in peace, George Michael. And these movies are definitely worth checking out, in my opinion. That's why I got them. So, yeah. Anyways, that's going to do it for this video, guys. Also, I will see you guys in my next video. Take care, everybody. And, of course, so long, everybody. And rest in peace to everyone who died in 2016. One more moment of silence. Anyways, that's going to do it for this video, guys. I will see you guys in my next video. Take care, everybody. And, of course, so long, everybody.